Your wife's hell-bent on divorce and is giving you no hope of reconciliation. Is there any way back from this? Yes, there is. And today I'm going to be sharing Brandon's story about how he went from his wife pushing for divorce to her doing a U-turn in only three weeks and them acting like newlyweds. Uh, can you explain to me a little bit um, what were you going through um, before you enrolled in the ARC system? So what were you experiencing in your marriage, brother? Uh, specifically in the marriage, we were, it was a lot of uh, uh, push and pull behavior. Uh, we would push each other uh, to whatever breaking points, and you know, and, but this is both of us. They would, would at different times, and then they we would start pulling away because the other wasn't reciprocating. They wasn't that we weren't getting the results that we wanted from the other from our 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 pressure that we were applying and then we just kind of start pulling away and then we go in this uh dynamic of having a lot of arguments and once we started pulling away we just be this distance is just void between us for weeks months at a time sometimes and then we'd start coming back together and then the cycle would start all over again and just it's a lot of push and pull behavior not gotcha. you and where had that gotten your relationship then to what point were you at before you enrolled in the ARC system? No. Numb. I, I, numb would be the best way to describe it. It's just numb over it, confused. I'm not really sure why it was going this way that we were we were doing really good and then now we're not. And they, they, I think it really hindered our, hindered uh, our desire to try to actually work on it just from the continuous uh, disappointment and discouragement okay and so when we talked um you and paula had been going through this cycle of kind of better time and then really bad times and then divorce being put on the table correct so what did you yeah. what did you what had you been trying so in the last few years as divorce kept kept, kept being brought up uh, what were you actually trying to, what, ha what had you tried to resolve the issues in your marriage before you came into the ARC system? So we, we went and spent some time doing a uh, couples counseling. We went and did our own individual counseling. We went and um, we tried doing, they taking an interest, more of an interest in what the other person said they liked and wanted. Uh, we also tried uh, um Oh, sorry. She's texting me right now. The uh, we also tried. Uh... There's, there's, there's the problem now. You've gotten too magnetic, and we have to beat her away. So <laughs> tell her you call her back later. <laughs> yeah. The uh, I know we um, we tried that, and then we tried taking an interest in in what the other person uh, each other liked. Uh, tried. Okay, here they showing they. For instance, Paula would tell me that she wanted um more affection from me and i didn't really know what she meant by that so i just kind of did that and then it just you know, i just kind of did what i thought was what she was talking about and then it ended up not being enough or not being the right way or whatever so and, and, and anytime i would hear that it's very discouraging it's like okay well i'm putting in more effort um in a, a spot that you said you you want and now you're telling me I'm doing it wrong. So like, what, what's the deal here? And uh, yeah, that's like that's like kryptonite for us men when we're trying and we're being told we're not doing it right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So why do you think all these things? So you did try different things: marriage counseling, and then trying to meet her needs, which I think you're talking about there. Why do you think none of these yeah, things yeah. were working? I wouldn't. Then I wouldn't be able to tell you at all, but it was, I think the approach was all wrong. I think the approach was wrong. The mindset, my own mindset in the matter was wrong. Um, it was pretty, uh, pretty simple, self-explanatory answer, just mindset and approach. Okay. Gotcha. And so just remind, remind me, when did you join the ARC system again? What was that? The... Uh... Three wow. weeks ago now. So you're three weeks into the program. So it's still pretty fresh. You're you're still pretty new in the program. Um, were there any hesitations then before you enrolled when you were like looking to come in 
Did you have any hesitations about coming into the Arc system? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, like what? Yeah, you you you're thinking you're you're, you're talking about a complete and total stranger. You're talking about you're telling a complete and total stranger your story, and then potentially giving a complete and total stranger a lot of money, a lot of your your own money, to do something that you don't even know is going to work. Uh, uh, and with everything, every, with everything that's out there now, with it between scams and people who really are just trying to make a quick buck on something, that you, there there are a lot of hesitations. There's a lot of things that come to mind. Sure. Um, and what what was it then that made you to get over? There, there's some hurdles to get over that all men have to get over before. So when they apply for the arc system, is so trust. <laughs> So is this a legit yeah. program and exactly all the things that you were saying there, is this going to work? Um, and do I want to give all my personal details? So what was it that made you get over those hurdles and, and, and apply for the ARC system? Uh, having an open mind and a strong desire to stay with my wife. Got you. Wonderful. Okay. And then, so what made you choose the ARC? Because we all know that there's plenty of programs out there. So what made you choose to come join us uh, in the ARC system? This is probably going to be the most clear answer I have off this list. The... <laughs> so there, uh, as you just said, there are so many different programs out there. Um, but what I've noticed, and it's a pretty consistent pattern, is the majority of these programs are based in manipulation. Yeah, and and you can see just by the way it's uh by the way they advertise it. You know, they talk about the uh, you know, uh, uh, there's there's one of them. How does it go? They they, they talk about like the close, underst like, under, understanding the feminine mind, how to get her yeah to to win yeah. her back and kind of stuff like this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but it has nothing to do with the actual work in the marriage. It just has something. It just has to do with a the, the feel good hormones, the feel good chemicals in your body, which quite frankly is bullshit. It's fucking icky, man. It's icky. Yeah, it. Uh, some of these, I I find myself like, uh, I find myself even cringing. So imagine what. So it might work in the short term, but imagine her finding out that that's what you've been doing all this time. They, yeah. they, everything starts going good. And then a month, two months, two years later, she finds out that that's really what you've been doing. Like how, how grossed out, how creeped out is she, is she going to be? Sure. And be worse off than you were before you started. For sure. And so what was the difference then for the arc system? Why did you choose the arc system? The, the main difference there is, uh, I don't know. I, I tend to get feelings. I can I can read people pretty well. Um, you come off as genuine. So, yeah, it's more about your persona, not what you say the arc system can provide, but it's more about your own persona. And you come off as somebody who's genuine. Plus, um, regardless of how much money it is your your price point comes in well underneath everybody else so it shows that not only are you not only do you believe in what you're doing and you care about it but you're not just trying to make every last dollar you can off of these people in their quote-unquote desperate situations gotcha Okay, and that's what a lot of these places. That's what a lot of these other programs capitalize on. They they, they capitalize on that that desperate yeah. feeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you. Um, yeah, it's 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 a shame, but um, that's one of the first things we work on with you guys when you come into the program is to get out of that fear because unfortunately, yeah, uh, on the in in the market there is a lot of fear and there's fear based marketing, and uh, I don't like that at all. But okay, I'm, I'm glad that you chose the ARC system. I'm very happy that you uh, your application was accepted. Um, so why don't you share a little bit how your how has your experience been? You're, so you're only in three weeks. Uh, how has your experience been since uh, joining the ARC system? It's been, it's been positive. It's been positive. It's been a long time since I've been part of a group, if you will, on, on social media, because, you know, that's you know, is pretty much the basis of it is you know, through social media, but it's been a long time since I've seen or experienced a group where there's no toxicity. It's very uplifting. It's very supportive. You got 
total strangers coming together. I mean, it, it helps that we all have similar mindsets. It helps a lot. Um, but it's been an overall positive experience. You get to connect with people. It's like, hey, uh, and there's this guy over here. It's like, hey, I can't help you with that, but I have something for the other thing you said. Um, and it's, I mean, in the last couple of weeks, say, in the last few weeks, say, I've been part of this. I've had a couple of questions say, um, where uh, a couple of the guys have challenged me on, like, well, what's what's the negative outcome if you don't do this? You know, so it's been overall, it's been a, it's been a, de- a good experience. So you've enjoyed having the sounding board and the the supportive community to be able to get real time feedback with your questions and also to be challenged on your own thoughts and beliefs. Oh, yeah. yeah, wonderful. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I think we have the the best community out there, uh, the Arc Legends. Uh, I'm so proud of the guys that are in the program, and uh, yeah, they're they're something else, and they I'm really happy of how they show up and support each other. Um, okay, so um, what would you say then are the the three specific benefits that you've gotten from the Arc system after? Because three weeks is nothing, man. You're only you're like still a baby in the program. So what what three <laughs> specific? What are the three specific, you know, kind of uh, benefits would you say you've gained from the program so far? Well, so we've already covered the idea that initially it was all about reconciling with my wife. Um, one of the, I think the, I think the top benefit is an all new outlook. Like like an all new outlook on, on everything, life, the way I see things, the way I see people, the way I see just everything. I wake up with a smile on my face. I go, I just, I carry a smile on my face. I can, I feel lighter. Wonderful. I, I feel lighter throughout the day. So that's, that's, that's one benefit there. Uh, another benefit is something we've already covered in another question was um, the sense of uh, community through accountability. What's changed? Maybe we look, what's changed in your relationship from your wife pushing for divorce? Where is your relationship oh, now after just a couple of weeks? Oh man, she, it's completely 180. It's a completely, she's a completely different woman. It's almost, it's almost like a, it's almost like when we were first starting to date. Like she's so, she's, she's so much softer. Um, she seems a lot more submissive in her, in her ways, like in her beliefs. Now, I don't want to say she's submissive as a woman because that woman is, very strong willed. Um, but she's definitely a lot softer in, in, in the way she goes about her interactions with me. Okay. She's smiling so, a lot more too. Wonderful, man. And so what do you think it's, what has been the change that's allowed this to happen to her, to go back into her feminine, open up, be in your words saying more submissive, um, having more fun together. So what do you think has a change? You, yeah. And what about you? What what were the, if you look at now going to the ARC system, what were, was it, do you think that has been key to going from your wife wanting divorce to now where you guys are reconciling? I completely backed off. I didn't tell her I was going to do this. I didn't make any, any promises. I just, I didn't say I was going to do this or do that or the other. I just told her, Hey, I'm going to, I'm going to start something and I'm just let you know because it's a large expense and um, I don't want that to turn into anything. So I'm just going to start this thing and uh, see what happens. Um, but me, so altering, altering my mindset, altering nice. the way I go through my day-to-day routine. Wonderful. Wonderful. So it sounds like by you uh, backing yourself and investing in yourself and doing it not to win her back and being needy, but because you wanted to process the hurt and heal yourself so you could start showing up as that strong, magnetic, independent man with exceptional communication skills, that Paula saw that, right? She was like, holy shit, he's doing this regardless of the outcome, whether we reconcile or not, he's doing this. He's in it for good. Yeah. And she right? told me, and she, yeah. And she told me that she like, 
yeah, I don't believe in coaches. I think they're full of shit. I'm like, all right, well. <laughs> well, you managed to get the coach with the who's the most full of shit ever. So congratulations <laughs> on that, man. <laughs> I told her, yeah, well, that may be, but I'm doing it anyway. Awesome. Is do you think she, maybe her her mind is changing on that a little bit now when she sees how incredibly you've grown in these last three weeks? I I think so. I mean, we went from where we were to me getting little notes here and there. Nice. So you can tell her a message from me. Suck it. <laughs> Coaching is awesome. <laughs> Wonderful. Awesome, man. Okay. So just a couple of final questions. So you're only in the program three weeks, man. How long did it take for your wife to do this U-turn? When did you first notice? Like, cause I mean, three weeks is nothing. And as we talk with all you guys, you want to get in the program and finish it, which is going to take you six months anyway. But within, you know, how long did it take before you started to notice her demeanor changing and from her pushing for divorce to where she's literally chasing after you. I mean, I remember specifically myself because we had this conversation, but why don't you share it with everybody else? So um, <laughs> how long did it take, man? How many days? Like, like a week, week and a half before she started like, making that U-turn. Yeah. And then it was full force like, by the time two weeks came around. It was like full force. There's a lot of passion in your relationship, man. It's wonderful. Yeah. Very cool. All right. So what's one thing do you feel like that you learned from the program so far that I didn't teach you specifically or isn't in the program? For just being around the arc legends, just being around the guys, what's one thing do you feel like that you've learned that wasn't explicitly in the curriculum? You know, so the the, the system comes out, you know, you know the system is advertised as a... a reconciliation guide or you know however you want to call it the um yeah you know let's reconcile your marriage but all the different works the, the shadow work as you call it the the, the different meditations when i i it's not i learned pretty quick it's not just for what you feel in your relationship what you feel the anger the the emotions that you feel specific specifically pertaining to your relationship i realized it pretty quick that this system isn't about that at all it's just a a, a desirable side effect of of uh what the system can provide so i've used tapping and meditation from for things i that happened in my childhood i go back to that that point in time and i'll build that rage i'll build that hurt i'll build that disappointment i'll build it just like I felt it when I was a kid and I'll meditate on it or I'll tap on it or, I'll, uh, or whatever. It's so it's not just, it's not just specific to your relationship. They, this, the, the stuff that's in this program is not just specific to the relationship. It's specific to you as an individual. Yeah, man, you're doing a lot of healing work. You guys, all of the guys in the group are doing a lot of healing work and it's really beautiful to see. And like you're saying, when you focus on what you control, becoming a strong, magnetic, independent man with exceptional communication skills and reconciliation is just a byproduct. We don't can focus on things we don't control because that just makes us weak and needy. So wonderful. Mm -hmm. So wrapping this um, call up uh, with you today, Brennan. So what type of person do you think would benefit from joining the ARC system? Somebody who has an open mind, who's willing to work on themselves. It's not going to work on somebody who just, who has a one track mind and that's it. It's not going to work with somebody like that. Right? Somebody who's arrogant and stuck in the ways that they, uh, like the ways that they are or the ways that they developed. Um, but it's exactly for the person who is curious about developing themselves, grow, like growing themselves. Okay. And for somebody that's watching this, like probably the way you would have watched one of these videos uh, um, a year or two ago um, before you enrolled in the ARC system, for somebody that's watching this video now um, and is considering, should I join the ARC system, uh, what would be your message uh, to them? If you, have the if you have the means to do it, then do it. Now there's, once again, we've already hit this point. It's, you know, we... You know, like you, you you want to reconcile with your wife, your significant other, your partner, whatever it is. Before you even start that, just get out of that mindset. They just do it for you. 
if you're feeling stuck somewhere, if you're feeling stuck on, on your own self, your own growth, your own personal existence, uh, this therapy hasn't worked. Maybe you haven't the therapy. Maybe you don't want to go to therapy. Just join the ARC system. It'll be, it'll be well worth. All right, Brandon. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day uh, to give us your testimony of going through the ARC system. I'm, gonna, I'm looking forward to continue working with you over the next few months. Um, I'm excited to see where this journey is going to go. So thank you very much, brother. Have a wonderful day. Would you like to get the same incredible results? Then watch this next video on my authentic method for attraction. Mm -hmm.